Hello, it's Warren here with Green Arrow Tech, and today I'm going to be demonstrating how to upload imagery from the Mavic 3M to your DJI Agris T40 remote controller using the DJIAG.com or the Smart Farm web platform. So the first step, once you have captured your imagery in the field, is on your computer, uh, go to DJIAG.com. This is the DJI Smart Farm web platform. You're going to agree to this uh, policy here. Click login. And then you're going to use your username and password that uh, you've already set up your DJI drone with. Click login there. You'll need to uh, agree to this account authorization. Hit confirm. That will come up every time. And then you're into the Smart Farm platform. Here we're in the media files section here. We're going to create a new farm. We're going to call it Ventura. Uh, that's the name of this project that I'm working with. Then under type, we're going to choose which type of imagery we're uploading. For the purposes of boundary mapping and creating uh, a spray application map, we're going to use the farmland option here. We're going to click save and upload now and now it's going to ask you to start sending in some images. So I'm going to select the folder that we've created here. So I've already copied from the DJI uh, M3M SD card. I've copied over the folder that contains all the mapping. So we're going to click on this. We're going to click upload. It's going to confirm that we have 130 files to upload here. This is a very small field, so that will be fine. Then we're going to turn on the auto mapping function here. And once we've selected that, we choose again the name of the field that we're going to have there. And then map resolution. So this, we have three different choices here. High 100% quality is great for fields that are smaller than 160 acres. Uh, medium or low is what you'll need to use for larger fields uh, because the high mapping may fail. It may take too long. So if you are getting failing on your fields. They might be too large, so you might need to bump down the quality here. For today, we're going to leave it at high because we've got only 130 images or 126 photos, uh, so it'll go pretty quick here. So we hit OK, and once we're in there, we can see this progress bar here, and we see that it is uploading the photos as we go here. So depending on your upload speed of your internet, this could take a few minutes to a few hours to overnight. Uh, and depends on how much you've captured there. As the system progresses through the uploading, you will need to leave it open on this page in a tab on your browser. You can do other things on other tabs there, but this one you'll have to leave as is. You'll see if you click anything else, it'll say exiting will stop the upload process. So you want to hit cancel and make sure that you just let this sit until it goes through. Okay, so we're just about done uploading here. So once that is complete, uh, now we can see, if we click Ventura, uh, that field, we can see the images that are all there. And if we go back here, we can go to our HD maps, and it will show that Ventura is in progress and processing. So we'll come back once that is done processing. So in this case here, we check and we see that actually our field failed. It doesn't give us a specific reason, but what we're going to do is before we hit try again, we're going to go back to our media files, into photos, and we're going to click on the mapping beside it here. We're going to change our quality down to 50%, hit OK, and then that's going to start it again, but this time at 50% quality. So we'll see if this goes a little better. All right, so that is now finished. So we can go into Edit. Just check everything here. It looks good. And if we click on the actual map itself, it'll zoom us over here. And now we see the imagery. And at this point here, this means that if we were to load it up on our controller and zoom over to that screen, this will now be showing up to our Agris T40 smart controller, assuming that we're connected in to the internet. So we can now create a plan based off of this new imagery that was captured.